and be sure to like this video, subscribe to the channel, and I hope you guys enjoy. Alrighty, so today what we are gonna do is, we, this is gonna be a short video, we are gonna do a little review of the Ryobi radio, the Bluetooth radio, the, the mini version that cost, I think, $44. Now this thing is awesome. Now I do know that Ryobi makes a bigger radio version, but that defeats the purpose of me wanting this one because I love the size, and I love how it actually sounds with the, with the size that it is. Now this is Bluetooth, and there is a USB port, and audio jack this thing is actually awesome i had this for about two years it works very well i'm in the garage full of full of tools so it's actually a really good radio so you uh this you are able to program this because you uh on the on the bottom you have to put uh two AAA batteries in there and so also with this radio, do not use HP batteries with this. Use the regular batteries. So because with the, this will malfunction and sh shut itself off if you use HP batteries uh, for too long. So you use the regular batteries that uh, Ryobi has. Uh, 1.3, 1.5, and four amp hour. That's pretty much what you could use with this. Do not use uh, any HP batteries with this unit. Is you know it, it's a radio. You know it, a 1.5 amp hour battery is going to last you a long time now. So what I do with this is I bring this on the boat. My wife uses this to do her gardening. I use it to do gardening. Uh, I have a little inflatable pool that I put on the deck, and I use this next to it. It's a it's a nice radio that's inexpensive. You know, like even the I think the Ryobi bigger radio. I think that's too expensive. That's why I like this version. This one, I dropped this a couple of times. It, uh, it, it's good. It's good. So this is model. So this is model number P seven four two. It is AM uh, five. It is AM to five twenty to seventeen ten uh, kilohertz. I might say that wrong. I'm sorry. It is that. So that's AM. So FM. 87.5 to uh, 107.9 megahertz, uh, 18 volt system, uh, 3.7 uh, amps USB charger. The, so this USB charger is a 1.0. And so yeah, that's pretty much it. But this is model number P742. Now this I love this radio. That's why uh, I do not. I am never gonna buy a radio from a different company because this to fit my needs. This one's perfect. Uh, if this one dies, I'm going to, when this one dies, I'm going to buy another one of these. I'm hoping that they do not change this or upgrade it. I love the design of this radio and the size. And it also has a little, a little strap that you could like put. My phone, like the phones got bigger since this came out. So we will see. And I have a case on it. Yeah, the, the, let's take the case off. So I have the iPhone uh, XR, so this is, the case just might be, yep, there you go. That's what, that's, that's exactly what it's for. It's for your phone. That fits there perfectly. Let's connect it to Bluetooth really quick. Bluetooth, right with radio. Connected. Let's see if it does any sound. Volume is goes to sixteen. Perfect. My new logo. Today, what we are going to do is we are. Alrighty, so the Bluetooth the Bluetooth works very well with this. So, but yeah, the this has just been a simple uh, demonstration of this. If you're interested in a battery operated radio, this is the one I recommend. A personal radio that it'll do a little area. So I don't plan on jamming the neighborhood. So I just want to do a. Uh, the area by me or even if family's over this is perfect so if you thought this was interesting please like the video uh, it helps out the channel a lot it is free to do so please subscribe to the channel hit the bell button to be notified of future videos if this is dave nicholas thank you for tuning in i'll see you guys next time